The previous differential aptitude test used on students had norms from South Africa. This has been changed and adapted to Namibian norms as performance standards are supposed to be applied to people from the same background. The differential aptitude test is used for selection of high-functioning students for intellectually demanding fields such as medicine, engineering, law and psychology, amongst others. This revised test was assessed on over 9,000 learners during the months of February and March this year. DATL is a test which we call a speed power test. A power test is a test which allows you to be able to answer all the questions and show your competence in terms of knowledge to the answers. Whereas a speed test, it will be testing your ability to think within the shortest possible time. Now, if we are selecting people to go and do, you know, piloting medicine, you do not have time to go and consult while the abdomen of a patient is open. You do not have time to go and consult while the aeroplane is falling. You must be able to think. So it taps critical thinking. And hence the DATL is a combination of an assessment of power and speed. This is a major milestone uh, for, the, um, for the Namibian um, population to know that when our children are being tested and being given career counseling, that we know that they're actually being um, um, tested appropriately. And then that also uh, the group that they are actually being compared to is relative. Some people may ask why we should embark on such academic researches. Most people go to school to pass and engage in careers which are common to them or easy to do. Very few people consider their abilities or interests in the given field of study. That is why students engage in study fields, in study fields which they eventually realize they are not good at or they are not interested in. These tests are seen as important in directing learners into an appropriate field of study and beyond to a job which they can excel in. Reporting for the News on One, I'm Bramalde English.